Hi, everybody. Dr. Friedman here. It is the end of week three here at Auburn in the TTRPG actual play research seminar. We are pivoting starting today into an introduction to different kinds of research methodologies. So today we spent some time where students got to pick an academic article related to tabletop role-playing or actual play and spend some time figuring out how it's structured. How is the argument built? What kinds of evidence are they using? All of those sorts of things. They will turn in that uh, project no later than Monday, but most of them would have gotten done in the 75 minutes we had. It's important for me, especially given the number of students who are not humanities majors, to uh, show them the broad range of methodologies that come under um, both game studies and specifically the study of tabletop. And so I think this was a good introduction. It's a day where I'm kind of hands off. I am literally the guide on the side answering questions and helping uh, folks figure stuff out. While they were working, I was working on their course contracts, which have just been submitted so that I could get a sense of how many actual plays we need to have in the queue for analysis, which is their main research task for the semester, as well as whether I needed to guide folks to any particular articles. Some students at this point are very clear on what their unessays will be. Um, some are trying their hand at actual play themselves. Others are going to be doing um, kind of auto ethnographies of their own play history and, and the like. And some people are still figuring out. It's week three and if you're brand new to this field, you're really still figuring stuff out and that is totally fine too. Um, so more conversations are coming in the fullness of time. And some of those will also continue next week when we talk to one of the folks in our, um, you know, human subjects research ethics uh, department, uh, which we'll do on Tuesday. And then on Thursday, when we talk about Alex Chalk and the um, challenges of working in actual play studies very specifically and you know, what can we learn? Um, you know, how are we iterating? What kinds of information do we have and don't we have? So that's kind of where we are at the moment. Uh, so we've gone from some very specific energizing contact with creators in the space um, to that kind of more distant uh, movement of analysis and argumentation and those sorts of things. Uh, two great tastes that I hope go to well together. And uh, so yeah, so that's that's all for today. It's it's not an intense day in terms of information I can give you aside from Analog Game Studies Journal is an amazing resource uh, for this and makes my life very easy when other resources kind of poof. Uh, so uh, talk to you soon and have a good weekend. <laughs>